Hello, this is Daniel from soundheadquarters.com. Super happy to be working with Signal Acoustics based out of the Toronto, Canada area to install their room essentials package. Here is a sneak peek of the finished product. We installed this for a professional composer here in the Guelph, Canada area. And let's get into the installation process. So when you work with Signal Acoustics, they're going to go through a whole bunch of phases. They're gonna do a, consultant, a consulting phase, a design phase. They're gonna tell you all the elements that need to be installed to your room that they ship professionally on site. And we're gonna handle the installation phase. And then after the installation phase, Signal will follow up with you to do any sort of room tuning or final touches that need to be done to ensure that your room has the best acoustics possible. And I'm gonna take you step-by-step step through the installation process, which is what our part and contribution was for this job. So here is the build specs that you're gonna get from Signal as well. They map everything out. It's full turnkey installation uh, plans here, which makes it really easy on my end to install. Um, and for the client's sake as well, you get full renderings, full 3D drawings of everything. So you're gonna know exactly how your room's gonna look before you even, even go ahead with the install. So now you can see that we have two panels going on the doors here for this job and they're mounted inch and three quarter off the top of the door. So I wanna get that mark first because these door panels, uh, since the height of the rest of the panels on the walls is gonna match the height of the panels that are mounted to the door, I wanna make sure I get that mark so I can set my laser there. And that laser is gonna dictate um, the height around the whole room. So you can see Signal, when they manufacture their panels, they actually build the French cleat into the rear side of the panel. That way the panel still sits flush on the wall, but we still get that one inch air gap between the acoustic insulation and the actual wall, which provides you with better broadband and low end absorption, uh, just making your panels perform even better. Uh, so here you can see we are using a steel cleat as well for some of these panels um, that are not gonna be using that existing French cleat in the rear side of the panel because this panel was mounted horizontally and this panel was mounted above the piano. Um, so we are using the steel cleat to mount the panel horizontally. So you can see that this cleat ends up being two and a half inches from the front or from the top of the panel rather. So now I know that the bottom of my cleat needs to get mounted two and a half inches from my laser line. So I have Christian helping me out today again, and we're just getting that very first panel um, installed over the piano so that the client still has enough room to open up his piano. Now we're installing the, the panels with the diffuser plates. This is a super cool custom touch that Signal can put on your panels as well. They CNC cut this, uh, the diffuser plates, and install them onto the front face of their panels. Really cool look, and you as the client gets to choose your fabric color, your paint color, for the diffuser plates. Everything's customizable at the build stage, and then someone like me will come and install everything. So here we are getting some hardware mounted for a very large existing panel that the client had. So this, this client had another large panel with a diffuser plate on the front as well. And this panel is quite big and heavy, so we're making sure that we get these L brackets screwed into the studs to make sure it can support the weight of this panel. And then we can screw from the bottom to secure the panel into the bottom of these L brackets to make sure that the panel is not going anywhere and that everything's nice and centered within the room. So just get everything tapped into place, screwed straight into those studs there, with wood screws. And once we have these bottom three L brackets installed, we can install the French cleats on the top of the panel as well. And these will be mounted into the same studs as well. To make sure that we have three stud mounting points on the top and bottom, making sure that this panel is more than safe and secure for this client. Um, especially being on the front wall, all of his gear being mounted right in front of it. It's imperative that this be strong and that the client have full confidence that this panel is not going anywhere. So you can see we're using our laser there. Uh, it's really important that all of the stuff be perfect with that laser line so that when we install this huge panel that we don't have to do any weird shimming or any sort of adjustment. We want everything to be dead on level straight from the, from the get-go. Here you can see those cleats installed on the rear side of the panel. So those are just gonna lock into those cleats on top. And the bottom of the panel is gonna rest on those L brackets that we just installed. And then we have our left to right adjustability before we screw the bottom of the panel into those L brackets to fully secure it into the wall. Now that we have that secured, we can go ahead and get ready to install our base traps since all of the wall panels are installed now. We're starting off with these smaller base traps uh, for the rear interior corner and this was for the client's request um, to get some sort of absorption in that rear left corner. Uh, kind of an awkward area, but Signal made these panels perfect to fit. Now we can install these huge floor to ceiling base traps. 
These we did the same deal where we did those L brackets into the studs to support the weight on the bottom of the base traps. And then I made some flat plates that I had to modify a little bit um, to be able to screw into the top of the studs as well to make sure that these base traps are fully secured into the wall. And the way that we did it, you can't see any of the hardware either, giving a nice clean insta installation look. And Christian helped me out there as well. Now that these base traps are installed, the walls are installed, the base traps are installed. The last element to install now is the ceiling clouds. And these ceiling clouds, super cool as well. You can see full build spec and location from Signal here on their plans. So we know that we have to have that five and a quarter inch um, little bit of angle on the front mix position cloud. And since these clouds are quite large and heavy, we installed strapping into the ceiling joists. And with this house being an older house as well, everything in this job was plaster, all of the walls and ceilings, which does make the installation process a bit more complicated. Um, but to ensure the full security of these large overhead panels, I'm screwing this wood strapping into the ceiling joist. I'm getting five screws into the wood joist on each piece of strapping here before I screw in my screw hooks uh, and locking carabiners, which is gonna secure these overhead panels. You can see the diffuser plates on those. And this is actually the client helping me out just get these large clouds just installed on the hardware there. And really cool final look. Client was beyond happy with this job and super happy to do it for him. He's a great guy and super stoked to hear how the job and the acoustics of the room is gonna benefit him for years to come uh, while he does his professional composing work. So here is the finished product. This is all ready for the client to move in his gear to get his speakers placed and finalized and to just really enjoy a professionally treated room. This is once again from Signal Acoustics. They're located in the Toronto area, just like I am, but they will ship and do work anywhere. So if you're outside of Toronto, Canada area, still contact them if you're interested in the Room Essentials package or if you're interested in even more custom work. They do all kinds of great work all over. Check them out at their website. Check them out on Instagram. Check them out everywhere. Same with me. Check sound headquarters out everywhere. Thank you so much for watching. I have a lot more really cool projects with Signal Acoustics coming up in the future. A lot more cool projects just from sound headquarters and myself. So I really appreciate you guys watching. This has been the first video of 2024. Super stoked for a lot more cool projects to come and really appreciate everyone watching and hope you guys can take something from this and just inspiration for your own studio as well. And really stoked to keep it coming. Lots of cool rooms coming. Peace out. This has been Daniel from Sound Headquarters. Take it easy.